a plane crash while he was on a humanitarian mission, crashed in the side of a mountain. So what do you want to know about Ron Brown? What do you want to know about can Ron I, can, Brown? Can you let me ask the question? No, I, I, listen, this Wait, is a conversation. You, no, no, no. We're having a conversation. I'm sorry. I'm the host. You invite yeah. me to your podcast. You get to ask the question. I'm, I'm, I'm the host. This is you, what's I'm going to ask you the question. You haven't I, let I, me answer I, the question. I, I didn't see Your the reaction book. is already an answer. I know. I am infuriated by people I who drag other people's why you name be. who are powerless. I, You're not powerless. Hillary Clinton is I'm powerless? Not, no, these people. Hillary Clinton is powerless. These people. That's the problem. These people. Hillary's the problem. You read a list of people because you have the power to do it. People who do that are bullies, and I don't appreciate bullies. I have the power to do what? You do. To read to a list what? of some strangers' names. I have the power to names. use the DOJ and other things to control That's and That's not things. DOJ. Yeah. DOJ me, didn't make this let list. Let me finish up some my question. Some jackass made a list in his basement. You have the right You're to answer. You're reading their names as if they're incriminating you in some way. You have the right to That's answer. That's bullying, and you I don't appreciate And I, I stand up against bullies. Please do so. He hasn't even asked the question yet, He's Anthony. reading a list, and he's refused. And now he says, let's move on. No, no. Because I set your answer Nobody already. has said move on. He hasn't even asked the question. I don't even know the question. Pick a name. I'm going to ask you a question. Reading and a, you get a to list answer of people who probably, not answer. And there are some of those people that had military titles in front of them, exactly. and you're dragging their That's name even through the point. You're dragging their name That's through the point. That's even the point. You should be ashamed of yourself. Because their families would want to know. Because you've got a podcast. Some of their you families would want to know. Some conspiracy theory podcast, uh, uh, some conspiracy theory oh, that nine people read. You. you find some guy that comes in, and then you buddy. go you go from Ron Brown to some obscure officer. Yes. That All right, guys. So we got to react to probably one of the wildest exchanges that I've seen on a podcast ever right and i'm doing this video about popular demand because multiple of you guys have sent me dms asking me to react to anthony weiner exposing himself right? <laughs> when asked about the clinton body count conspiracy okay now this guy goes into a full-blown meltdown over this idea that you know there are a bunch of people that were associated with hillary that died okay under mysterious circumstances and people have speculated whether or not the clintons have something to do with it now here's the issue right i don't know if this conspiracy theory is true or not right i, I don't know but i think it's reasonable for people to ask questions and to say hey maybe these things are connected maybe they're not however democrats for whatever reason don't want you to ask questions right if you ask questions then they call you a conspiracy theorist, uh, specifically if you ask questions about the establishment narrative, okay? If you question the establishment narrative, they call you a conspiracy theorist. And they do that as a way to smear you, to stop you, to silence you from, again, questioning the narrative. And Anthony Weiner here uh, is going to go into a full-blown meltdown because Patrick Bet David simply just brings up this conspiracy and starts talking about it and starts naming some names and patrick De bet david wants to ask anthony weiner a question anthony weiner is you know very close to the clintons right he wants to ask anthony weiner a question and instead of just waiting for the question to be asked anthony weiner loses his mind right because he doesn't like the fact that patrick bet david is talking about what he deems to be a conspiracy theory now i want to be clear here okay this conspiracy theory, according to Wikipedia, has been debunked, okay? So, again, I'm not sure if it's true. I don't know, but I don't think there's anything harmful about asking questions, right? And uh, apparently, Anthony Weiner does think that it's something harmful about it, right? And, again, that's why he loses his mind over Patrick Bet David simply asking questions. Or, who knows, maybe Anthony Weiner has something to hide right i mean i'm, I'm just saying I, I don't know but i i'm starting to think that consider how this guy reacted so i want to react to it and uh go from there so without further ado let's go ahead and, and get into this i'm gonna stand oh, up for oh him. trust me we are standing up for them more than you are let's standing say, up for them let's see you better get my back to that list because question, we're gonna clear some people's my, names today my question for you is my question for you is how is it that in the last 50 years we don't have a single candidate Everybody has their own. Hey, John F. K. was a playboy with Marilyn Monroe. Trump, Karen McDougal, Stormy Daniels. You know, George Bush linked to 9-11 and weapons of mass destruction. Bill Clinton linked to Arkansas women, all this others. Everybody has a reputation. How is it that the reputation that follows them as people close to them die? Why right. is that a story that people, many people believe in? Why is how, that? Are the Clintons in their 70s yet? 
If I, you don't think I can make a list of other people who are 70 something years old and say this person died, How come that they person done died, that with this Bush? person died. Hold on. How come they haven't done that with Bush? He's in the same, same I age. I have no freaking idea why they haven't done that with Trump. How come they haven't done that with Trump? Hold on a second. But, so are you saying, so you agree with what How I'm saying? How come they haven't done that with Reagan? So How come they haven't done that with Kerry? What point are you making about these men and women How who you listed? How is it so many people close to them died? How is it so many people, people close, close to, to them everybody has died? How is are it you so suggesting? Many Okay. I'm asking the question. You're is what asking I'm doing. a bizarre question. Exactly. Did it's people die? You off. Did people die? No. What pisses me off, and I'm going to say what? this again because you, you apparently are not listening to me. You read a list yeah. of people off an obscure website that 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 of, of conspiracy theory, taking a Venn diagram of everyone that ever worked in the orbit of someone who served in public life for 50 years, and you listed them, including people in the military, including strangers you could not pull out of a, and you are implying. Let me, let me that, simplify that there's something you, to fair. Let, let me finish my thought. Oh, let me finish my thought. Please do so, because I got another let me finish my thought. here for you. You're implying both yeah. with the question and with the website. The website says it explicitly. I you're implying you it. Website. Let me finish. Go ahead. You're Don't implying that until, something. Until he's done. You Don't are pull it up until he's done. Go for it. You are implying that something nefarious is afoot both with the question yeah. and with the list. Hillary Clinton, she's a big girl. I'm a big boy. You're a big boy. The people that you just listed. They're all... Listen to me. No. Yeah. These are obscure people that you could You're not pull out of... You're a great politician, buddy. Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me, let me, Fantastic. You know what? You are, you are, you are the yeah. classic bull. You list someone's name. You are and Are you going to go back if and clarify If there's anybody that's... The yeah. So here's the thing. I don't think what Anthony Weiner is saying is like wrong. I don't think he's necessarily wrong in the sense that his argument is that, well, you know... Uh, Hillary being in politics for so long and being around so many different people, you know, people are going to die, right? I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I, what he's saying is it, it's not illegitimate. The problem is how he's saying it. The problem is that this guy is getting so upset just from the idea of somebody asking questions. Now, that's the issue, okay? And I think that this is the same issue that... A lot of people have when it comes to these so-called conspiracies is that, you know, if it's not true, you can easily debunk it, right? You can say, look, it's not true for X, Y, and Z reasons. You know, we look through the congressional record. You know, this person's looked in into it. That person's looked into it. It's not true, right? You you can simply just disprove it, right? But no, that's not the way these people react. What they do is that they want to throw a fit and accuse you of violence and and being harmful just for even asking a question, right? Again, that's the problem here. It's not what he's saying, it's how he's saying it. Are you going to go clear about it? You know what the Are you going to clarify your personality this list? Is. You I don't really you know that. Ad hominem attack on me yeah. is going to somehow Classic clear that bully. person's name? There's isn't anybody at this table that's a bigger bully than I you. I tell you. Oh, yeah? You you just yeah. listed some stranger with, with Very PFC. Very good, deceptive with PFC. way of pinning. Good Look for at you, you guy. You're reading some. <laughs> good you're, for you. You're reading a, 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 a conspiracy <laughs> website. Good for you. Some people say. Yeah. Some people say. Look at that fucking website. to you. Pull you, up the Wikipedia. Is Wikipedia wanna, a conspiracy website? You want to take, no, 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 you wanna take a run Wikipedia. at me? Bring it all day, pal. No, hey, Bring it all day. Sweetheart, take a run at me. Clinton not, body count. Conspiracy theory, yeah. right at the top. Wait, wait can I what, throw a mic I can drop? Conspiracy, right the, at the what's top. The, what's the point with that? The point is conspiracy the point theories are by their very definition unsubstantiated. Yeah. How come other people don't have this conspiracy theory? How come Reagan doesn't have this conspiracy oh, theory? Oh, wait a minute. How come Bush doesn't have this conspiracy theory? How come John Kerry doesn't have this conspiracy theory? How come John Kerry doesn't Oh, wow, oh, really? Why do they, though? Some of the stereotypes are true. Like, you have some reputation. It's true, some of it. <laughs> yeah. He got a long reputation, okay? His reputation ain't good. That's why he's not in politics anymore. Some of the stuff they say about other people that's is true. That's not a stereotype. That's a made-up story about oh, strangers. How come others don't have that made-up story? People have it all the time. No, Look no. at the internet. Give me another body count with another president or candidate. Give me do another person. Do you really think that someone within the Do me a favor do you and really another... Think Barack Obama body count. Do you really think? Oh, you want to go, go? Why don't you go to Barack Obama? Not born in this country. By right. the way, where was that podcast? Yeah, I mean, well, that's the point. The point is that there are certain conspiracies that are associated with certain politicians and major U.S. political figures. It just so happens for Hillary, this is the conspiracy that's associated with her, and that's why he's asking about it, right? I don't understand. Anthony Weiner is so upset that he's like he can't like calm down right calm down get out of your emotions and just let patrick bet david ask the question and if you can debunk it then just debunk it right i mean it should really be that simple if 
this conspiracy theory is not true, right? Which, I mean, he says it's not. So, again, it, it shouldn't be too hard to debunk this, right? But, again, it seems to me that he's not interested in debunking it as much as he's interested in yelling as loud as possible to make sure that there's no questions that are asked, which, again, this is par for the course in regards to how Democrats handle these situations. Did you guys do that one? No. That's never why? anything we discussed. Oh, why? Oh, come on. So people say it. Anthony, there's a, pod, there's a, there's a, there's a Wikipedia yeah. thing on it. Huh. These people are strangers that you just read a list of, and I think out of deference to them... You're a dark human being, of, guy. Of, you're pretty down, dark. Settle down, pal. Settle down. No, no, no. You're you pretty dark if you take the out. angle you did. You're you should exactly... Cut, listen to me. Talk, you're talking to yeah, us yeah, now. Yeah. Oh, okay. You should cut that list out of those sure. people. Absolutely. We can still have the argument. You no, and I are big absolutely. boys. Cut that list I'm out. I'm not going to be cutting that list because the world That's needs... That's right. Here's what everybody yeah, needs the to... the world needs... You, that poor person's family that you can't even name. Exactly. That no. That some people say... What does it matter now? They're some dead. Some people say. What does it matter now? Some They're people dead. say. Can you play that clip Famous again? Famous podcast play host says some again. people say. Play that clip again. What does it matter now? What does it matter These now? These people. What does it matter change now? Change the subject all you do, want. Do you, Anyone you, who read that list no one's changing is still the waiting for you to come back to that realize, list and apologize to those people. Do you realize why some people? Apologize to those people. Do you realize why some people? You should are, are, apologize are, to those people. Why do you keep saying that? What because does he need to apologize those people, about? The, listing those people on some obscure website as if something about their death was shrouded in some kind oh of a mystery dishonors their is, memory. Now, if you, Okay, so look, here's the thing. If that's the case, right, if if we know exactly how they died, why they died, it should be e very easy to disprove, right? It should be very easy to disprove. But instead of, again, engaging in the conversation, right, and actually disproving it, he wants to scream and yell and cry about the question being asked in the first place. Again, it's ridiculous. It's, it's, it's so <laughs> ridiculous. And here's the thing, again, the reaction here is making people believe things that this man doesn't want them to believe. When if he just would have stayed calm and just answered the question, you would have less people believing in the conspiracy, right? I mean, these people, they, they work against themselves, okay? I don't understand. I really don't. You are, if you are Hillary Clinton or Anthony, if you are Hillary Clinton or Anthony Weiner, that yeah. may sound fine. If you are some Make person, bigger, if you are some person who has one of these jackasses on the internet showing yeah. up at their doorstep yeah. saying, "Tell me about the Make death of bigger. your father, how did Hillary Clinton?" We had someone walking. Nobody's doing that, right? Nobody's doing that. Okay, and if, if somebody does do that, obviously that should be condemned. That's not right. People shouldn't be doing that. But again, you know, you got people in the streets. Uh, I mean, basically putting their lives in danger over the conspiracy that the world is going to end in 12 years because the sun is too hot, right? Climate change. Democrats put that conspiracy theory out there every single day and people are putting their lives in danger over it. But you don't hear these people complaining about how dangerous it is to say that, right? How dangerous that rhetoric is. It's a conspiracy that white cops are in America out here uh, looking for black people to kill in the streets in cold blood and people lost their lives over that. But you don't see people talking about how harmful that conspiracy is. Again, it's just so funny to me which conspiracy theories are deemed to be harmful and which ones are not. The ones that come from the Democrats that actually are harmful, right, that actually have resulted in real world violence and death and destruction and chaos that's not off limits to talk about in the spread, right? But if you talk about some other conspiracy that happens to originate from people on the right or people that disagree with, <clears throat> with the establishment narrative, that's deemed to be harmful, regardless of how many people have actually been harmed by it uh, in reality. It's just amazing how that works. Into a pizzeria in Washington with yeah. a gun because of I've assholes that, like I've this. I've heard that phrase before by other people. Play it again. Play it again. I've heard this phrase. Oh, a by the way, watch times. the whole Benghazi. Let's go. get the whole Benghazi. No, no, it's the phrase. The fact is, we had four no, dead Americans. Was it I because agree. of a protest, or was it because of you guys out script. for a walk you, you when they decided to go kill some Americans? You disagree with her Listen point here? The Difference at Play this that again. point. Play that three times. You disagree with this Play point? Play that from the yeah. <laughs> so, again, you guys seen that? You heard that? Um, again, the reaction here tells you everything you need to know. Okay, from Anthony Weiner. Uh, he could have easily just come on a podcast and disprove the conspiracy, okay? If it's that easy to disprove, if it's not true, okay? Which he says, that's what everybody says is not true. He could have did that, but instead he threw a fit, and now he hasn't disproven anything. And now you have people that, again, probably believe in it more so than they would have just because of this man's reaction. It's amazing how that works.
Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Most importantly, share a black conservative perspective. Peace.